welcome to Woodbridge, the best town around. My name is John McCormick. I'm the mayor of this great town. We're here tonight at the Woodbridge Community Center for Devils Youth Hockey Appreciation Night. With me is Colin White the Stanley Cup winning player from the New Jersey Devils. And first, Colin, thanks for coming out to you, talking night, and thanks for being on. Oh, it's great. Great to have a little drive down, but... Uh, Where are you coming from? Great facility here in Essex County. That's okay. I know you're yeah. from Nova Scotia, but I didn't think you were there originally, in the, yes. original life. Uh, no, no, nice facility here. So tell me, growing up, how long have you been playing hockey? Uh, since I was four. I started playing in a league when I was five, and, uh, you know, had a lot of great help along the way, and um, still love the game. And you, you reached uh, you know the pinnacle of any young man's dream career. Every kid playing hockey all across you know North America and, and you know in Europe everywhere dreams of a Stanley Cup, and you got to do that. 2003 New Jersey Devils. Yeah, I mean uh, 2003 was great. Uh, 2000 was a rookie year. I won there. Um, it was uh, just a, a great group of guys. A lot of support from community coaches trainers, whatever, um, you know, a lot of help along the way, but to, to hoist it up and to share it with the fans was an uh, unbelievable feeling. And what does it mean to be a New Jersey Devil? Well, I mean, I, I only played for one other organization for one year, so it meant a lot to me. Uh, you know, Lou Lamorello uh, put it into our heads, you know, uh, we played for the crest uh, on the front and not the name on the back, and that was a big part of a, a great family. Uh, Tell me about the uh, Devils this year. What do you think? They're, um, by the way, I'm a diehard Devils fan. So tell me what you think their shot uh, is this year. Well, I think they've been playing really good. I think they've been doing more, a uh, better job being consistent this year. They they got their identity back, and uh, I think uh, Coach Hines and uh, Ray Sherrill and them done a great job coming in. Uh, I know it's uh, a culture shock to everybody when uh, one, one person ran the organization for so long and did such a great job, but I think they did a really good job. Uh, you know, getting the fans' belief that hey, everything's going to be all right, and we're we're going to have a good team from here on out. And the goalies look great. Schneider's on fire. Made the All-Star team. Kincaid comes in, holds the Kings to uh, what a shutout, one nothing, after they scored five goals against the Flyers the night earlier. So that yeah, they, they they've been both playing really good. The goaltending. I mean, everybody uh, as a group, they they're playing a team game, which is uh, very important. And uh, I think we got away from that for a couple of years, and I think they're back on track. Now, tell me, last last group of questions here about youth appreciation. Why do you think it's important for the Devils to get involved with kids at this young age and, and you know turn them into fans early? Well, it's important to everybody. I think sports plays a, a major role in, in a lot of kids' lives, whether it's swimming, hockey, whatever. Um, you get to meet friends, meet people. Um, you know, give back to community once you're older. I, I mean, it's a big commitment by parents getting their, their kids to and from sports. Especially uh, hockey, because it's not cheap growing up. Yeah, every sport. I think it's really important for a kid mentally uh, just to be involved and be part, part of a team and uh, get them communication built up. Well, thanks very much for coming out. We appreciate you uh, being here. Thank you. Thanks. thanks Colin White, New Jersey me. Devils, double Stanley Cup winning player. Thank you for coming out. i got a lot of kids here waiting to talk to you, so I'll let you go. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks for watching.